Alrighty guys, Satsy the Clown here with a sad-tastic top 10 list of the most powerful, held to my heart, cherished console of all, the Super Nintendo, the SNES, the SNES, whatever you want to call it, it is that great in my opinion, but this is a great console. But most of all, what makes a great console? Great games. So what are the greatest games? What are the top 10 games? I could have just chosen my top 10, chucked them in a list, and then just rattled them off. They're not going to be the top 10s you'd choose, or he would choose, or he would choose, or they would choose. So that's why I thought, let's chuck it on Facebook. Chucked it on a few different pages. Everyone gave their top three games. You got points depending on first, second, and third. Tallied them up, and now I have a top 10, which I'm about to share. Love you! So, let's move on to number 10. <laughs> so, number 10. I'd love to show you pictures of all these. I don't own all these games. But number 10 is, in my opinion, one of the most overpriced games there is. But apparently, makes number 10, so it's not an overrated game. We had Mega Man 10. Like I said, I don't have it, which means I haven't played it. But I've seen people play it, and it looks pretty damn awesome. But that's number 10, Mega Man 10. <laughs> okay, so number nine. Number nine I used to rent out quite a bit. Loved the use of the chain and a bit of this going on. I bet you know what game it is. It's Castlevania 4. Like I said, used to rent it as a child. Now I own it. Haven't played it a lot. So, looks like top ten. I'm going to have to get back onto this. <laughs> hmm. Number eight, right? It's a bit touchy. It's a, it's a controversial subject for me because I feel that number eight should be higher on the list. It should. I even think it should be in the top five. What we have here is one of Nintendo, one of the Super Nintendo's greatest games. I think top five for sure. Boom! Super Mario World 2, Yoshi's Island. This game's amazing. Great soundtrack. Ah, uh, let's see. I think that's how the song goes. That was for free. That was a little treat. Just for you. So anyway, number eight. Yoshi's Island, Super Mario World 2. <laughs> so, number seven. Number seven. I, uh, have never really had a lot to do with this. I remember my mate used to have it, I think. And I watched him play it a few times. It looks great. I'm gonna admit right now, I'm not an RPG player. So this list, if it was my decision, it would be shed a little of the RPG style games. They got a lot of votes. In the whole list, a lot of votes. So number seven comes in at Chrono Trigger. Chrono Trigger, tri Chrono, Chrono Trigger. Trigger, Chrono Trigger. You know the name. Everyone out there who plays Super Nintendo knows the game I'm talking about. Like I said, I haven't played it, so I can't tell you any more. I don't even know what the game sounds like. Hmm. Shall we go to number six? I think so. <laughs> so number six is... I can't show you because once again, I don't own this game. I'd like to own this game, but it's never just come along and appeared in my hands, so I don't have it. But what it is, is Super Metroid. Powerful game. Obviously, it's gone on to make so many sequels. I think they've just announced another one. Could be wrong, but I think they did. That, I think, says enough. That shows how strong the game was from the very start. <laughs> so, five and six, eh? This was close. So close that they added up to be the same total number. I had already decided before a draw happened. Didn't think it was even going to happen, but because it happened, a draw goes down to which game had the most number one votes. Which brings us down to, drum roll please, <laughs> Donkey Kong Country 2. Fantastic game. So good. This game is amazing. You know, Donkey Kong 1 was great with Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong, but Dixie Kong, oh Dixie Kong. Everybody wants to be Dixie Kong. That hair, that hooking by the hair, that helicopter action. We love it, we love it, we love it. And obviously, that's why it hits number five. <laughs> so that brings us to number four. So who is this game? Which game? Just by the edge of its teeth! Scraped above Donkey Kong Country 2? Well that would be... BOOM! Donkey Kong Country 1! How close! Epic battle! The two Donkey Kong coming so close! Three didn't get in, but one! 
What an amazing game. This was another game that a friend owned. I used to love going to the house just to get a bit of that Donkey Kong action. I didn't care if I was Donkey Kong or Diddy Kong. Both were so great. The graphics were amazing. The sound effects were fantastic. Getting that boom, boom, boom. Smashing the ground, getting those bananas out. Everything about this game is amazing. Everything. <laughs> so, the top three. The top three dogs, all well earning of their spots. But in third place, really well deserved, is Super Mario Kart. This game is amazing. This one has my last name written across the bottom because it was one of the first games we got. But we came with our Super Nintendo. We bought our Super Nintendo second hand and this is one of the games we got to choose with it. I love it. The amount of hours I've spent on this game, as many others probably have done the same, is huge. And the Nintendo has gone on to create one Mario Kart game per console, which proves, in my opinion, how great it is. They don't overpopulate the consoles with this game. They make one per console, and every one of them is as great as the last. Super Mario Kart, well earned third place. <laughs> okay, so number two, huge spot. I don't own this game and I haven't played it. I'm so sorry, so I can't even tell you a lot about it. But going by the votes, it is Zelda Link to the Past. Like I said, haven't played it, can't tell you a lot about it, but it's a Zelda game. And just like the others, they've made so many Zelda games that obviously Zelda Link to the Past is just one of the greats. <laughs> and here we are, number one. This is the game we've all been waiting for. And I reckon if you're watching this right now and you've got this far, you'll know what game this is. I don't even need to hold it up. All together now, say it with me. Three, two, one, Super Mario World. Greatest game ever. This was my number one choice as well. That's how good this game is. The first Yoshi. You get to ride Yoshi, you get to... Oh. Everyone's played it. I don't need to say anything about it. The soundtrack's amazing. The graphics are amazing. The gameplay is so smooth. I thought Super Mario All-Stars was gonna get in the top 10 just because it's such a common game. But I'm so glad that this beat it because this, out of all the games that have been made of the Mario series, even to the newest consoles, in my opinion, this is still the best. Well earned, Super Mario. Well earned. <laughs> It's a well-earned first place, well-deserved. But before you go, before you go, I just want to point out there's so many games. If this was my list, it would have been so much different. All the RPGs probably would have been gone out of the list. I'm not saying they're not great games because they probably are and I know so many people love them. But not for me, I'm not an RPG guy. I've got a little pile of games here. I don't even own all the games I'd love to say in this, right? But like Contra 3, which is Alien Pro Protector, I think, for us, that's amazing. That should be up there. Turtles in Time. Again, I don't own it. I'd love to own it. Way overpriced, but it's amazing. I don't, that should... How did that not get the top 10? Because the Super Nintendo has so many great games. For example, what have I got here? If this was a sport contest, how can NBA Jam not be in the top? NBA Jam is one of the greatest sport games ever made, in my opinion. Here we go. Rock and Roll Racing, one of the greatest car games ever made. This game's amazing! Okay, and the soundtrack, oh, I almost don't even need to say the soundtrack is great in all these because oh, Super Nintendo nailed the soundtrack. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, amazing game. I don't know what it is about this game, don't know if it's the label, don't know if it's the gameplay, don't know if it's the sound effects, but Total Carnage, Total Carnage is so awesome. This is a unique game, it's a bit different, but Unirally was great. It didn't even get a single vote, I don't think. And I know it's not fantastic, but it's unique. They don't make games like this anymore. This is awesome. As far as fighting games go, we didn't get any in the top 10. Super Street Fighter Turbo 2, I think it's called. That's an amazing game. That got quite a few votes. Didn't get in the top 10 though. Killer Instinct is amazing. This, this got a lot of votes too, but didn't get in the top 10. I just think these are worthy of having just a little bit of a say. And the thing that breaks my heart the most, they got on the list, but they didn't get in the top 10. How did none of these get into the top 10? Fair enough, I'll accept Mortal Kombat 1 didn't get in. I'll accept Mortal Kombat 3 didn't get in. This game's amazing, but I'll accept it didn't get in. And even Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3, which is one of the greatest Mortal Kombat games, but this is the one. Mortal Kombat 2, this was, this was a big chunk of my childhood. Once again, going to one friend's house. I never owned it. They owned it. I loved it. Loved every character. I love this game so much. Just needed to say that this should be in the top 10. But it's not. So anyway, that's the end of the video, guys. Thanks for coming on that journey. That was the top 10 Super Nintendo games. I'm pretty happy with the results. There's a few games like Mortal Kombat 2 that I feel should have got in there. Let me know in the comments if there's any games that you felt strongly should have been in the top 10. Otherwise, 
please hit that like and subscribe. Also, before I leave, if you want to see a top 10 of anything, if you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see the top 10 cartoon characters, top 10 wrestlers, top 10 fruits, I don't care, let me know in the comment and we'll get them happening. I've been Sad to the Clown and I'll catch you all next time.